Good Monday morning. I'm going to help you with my $50 mistake so that you don't make it. Now, for years, I had a snowblower. You could, at the end of the season, just leave it, have gasoline in it. The next winter, it would start right up, no problem. But that one died after about 21 years, and I had to buy a new snowblower last year. And I did the same thing. Went to go start it this year, it wouldn't start because I'm told now that new engines don't like ethanol. So I brought it to the shop, and here's what they said you have to do now. With a new engine in a new snowblower or smaller equipment like that. You got to put the old gas into your car because the car can handle the ethanol. You got to relabel the gas can and then go down to the corner and get recreational fuel that has no ethanol. It's off on to the side and it's mid grade gasoline, double the price of regular gasoline, but chances are you're only going to use one can about a year, so it's not that bad. At the end of the season, you're going to want to use gas stabilizer both in the machine and in the gas can because if you do this, you won't spend that $50 that I had to to get my snowblower fixed.